Hey guys, I'm Joel Brites, or Joel Brites, if you like to say it in Spanish. I'm from Paraguay, and I have been studying at Pittsburgh State University for four semesters. Um, I am studying political science and international studies. The reason why I am shooting this video is because I want to tell you my story, guys. Um, as I was finishing high school, I, I realized that I really wanted to do something in order to change the reality of my country. So I decided that I wanted to study political science, since that's um, the field that one has to um, dominate in order to be able to help a government um, to manage the country properly. So I decided that that was um, what I wanted to do. Um, I also knew that I did not want to stay in Paraguay to, to study that uh, major because I wanted a, 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 a better education. I, want, I wanted a, a, a higher education. So I decided to apply to universities in the U.S. I got a scholarship through the Department of State of the U.S. It was called Opportunity Funds. This scholarship gave me the opportunity, uh, it gave me the chance to apply to universities here um, for free. I didn't have to pay for any documentation. I didn't have to pay for my test. It was everything uh, given to me for free. Um, so I started applying to universities. Um, I didn't know what was gonna happen. I just did it and I, I was rejected by some of them. I was accepted by some. And I, um, my, best, my best option was Pittsburgh State, which is a university in Kansas, the one I am studying in right now. Um, I still didn't have the money. I was missing like $7,000 for um, to pay everything to come here. And I was like, man, I don't know how to do this. I don't know how uh, I'm gonna go there. I, I, do, I do know I have my flight ticket already because of the scholarship. And I just wanna, I didn't want to lose that opportunity. So I set this mindset that I was gonna come here. I didn't know how. I didn't have the money, I didn't have uh, um, the way of doing that, but I knew I wanted to come here. So I, I started working for that. Um, I started doing raffles. I posted a, um, something in Facebook saying that I um, got into the University of the U.S. and that I needed help, and my post got viral. And everybody in the country, um, most of the people started sharing it. Most of my friends started sharing that post. Um, the post got in the um, news hands, so the uh, many newsletters started contacting me. Many TV shows, radio started calling me. It was the other day I was waking up and I was already getting a call from a radio um, asking me um, what was going on. So I started getting a lot of help from many people who I never really met before, many donations, people saying that they believe in my cause and that they really wanted to help me. And all of a sudden, I think it was like two weeks before um, my trip, I got like $7,000 that um, was the money that I needed in order to come here. So it was unbelievable. I, I, I couldn't really um, believe what was going on and neither could any member of my family or anybody who was friends with me. And I ended up coming here. I don't know how, I don't know um, any of the reasons why it happened, but it happened. And I just want to tell you today that this is my second year and I did this like two other times um, and I still got the money from people who I, I didn't really know, but um, I, I, got, I got all the money that I needed for my first semester, my second, my third, and now my fourth semester. It's been happening in a row. So I, I, I want to tell you guys um, that if there is something that you need to know is that nothing is impossible. If you really want something, if you really um, have a, a, if you really know what the purpose in your life is and you really work hard for it, it is going to happen because it is going to happen. If you really set your mind in that you have to achieve a certain goal, you will achieve it just because you will. Um, again, I am Joel Brites or Joel Brites. I don't know how I ended up here, but because I wanted something, because I had a goal and I worked hard for it, I ended up being here. And that's why I am a, fir I, I am a first round draft pick. <laughs>